Morning. Uh, what'd you get? Would you go 15 a piece if I bought three? Oh, you had a tape in there. Oh my. <laughs> Morning. She had this UK golf bag for 20 bucks. The only one that I saw actually sold went for about 50, but this one had like some brown spotting in the front and I just don't know that it would have sold or been worth the hassle, so I passed. How much are your DVDs? Um, they're all marked. Oh, okay. Price on each one of gotcha. I've got five dollars worth here. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Morning. Ah, uh, what'd you get? <laughs> Just kidding. I did get. <laughs> here, you want a hand? No, I got it. Two, two bows and some classical music. Very nice. What'd you pay? Uh, 20 each on these and two bucks on that. Not too bad. Hopefully they work. Yeah. You know. I'll give you 50 bucks right now. Mm. Make 10 bucks. Ah. <laughs> You'd kill me if I did that. Right. Good luck to you. Good luck. Tell them I said hi. I How much are your toys? Uh, whose toys? Rita, that's Rita. Rita, toys. Is this one yours? No, that's mine. That's yours too? How much are the toys? Um, ten. I think I'll pass on those. Would you go five on this? Not right now. Okay. Since we're just getting started. Like everything's good with it. I'll do the ten bucks. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thanks. Thank you. How much are your speakers? Did you say twenty? Each? Yeah. Gotcha. Would you go 15 a piece if I bought three? Uh, now, not that loud one. That's not a speaker. Gotcha. <laughs> You're not asking 20 for that one? No, that's... Uh, that's actually, I haven't decided yet. Probably 40. Okay, I'll pass on that. But if you'd go 15 a piece, I'd buy these two. Okay. All right, thank you. Thanks so much. So what, uh, oh, okay, so you already, you already paid I paid for, for the okay. other one, yeah. Okay. Have a great day. Mm -hmm, you too. Okay. Good morning. Is an adult toy. <laughs> Are you three dollars? Thank you. Good luck with the sale. <laughs> Thank you. 
You mind if I plug this in? You got something in it, I just don't want to unplug it if it's going to mess anything up. Oh yeah, um, here, can you here we go. over to here or I can get it? Yeah, if you can get that, I can lift it up a little bit and get it over there. I just want to see if it turns on. Let me open this with it. Do you have the remote for it? Uh, no, I don't think we do. can hear it's thinking there we go yeah let's see here Chat. oh you had a tape in there oh my. <laughs> um i guess we should have turned that on and checked let's see open close dvd that works that's good i'll take it okay you mind unplugging it and i'll uh I think just um, we'll, uh, back up into the driveway. That's all right, just to make the load a little bit easier. Sure. There you go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. How much are these? How much are these? Oh, they're not marked. Um, I don't think this goes with it. I got something. No, you're right. For a propane tank or something. Um, dollars for all of them. Sold. Thank you. I'll go ahead and uh, back up and load up the TV. Okay. Sounds great. Would you take 20 for your TV? Sure. Okay. Thank you so Thank much. You. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. I appreciate it. How much is your TV? Chuck. How much you want for that little TV? I didn't see a power cord. Thank you. The one that was in there ain't the one that goes to it. Uh -huh. um, couple bucks. How much? Couple bucks. Yeah, I'll do a couple bucks. How much is this guy? A dollar. All right, I'll get three. I'll set it up here and I'll get you paid. There you go. Thank you, sir. I'll Thank keep looking you. around and see what else I can find. Uh -huh. I'm still looking Morning.
Come on, Shirmavis. Um, are those yours, Aaron? Or Aaron? Mm -hmm. Oh, what are they, too? Yeah, I got two DVDs oh, and a VHS. Oh, um, uh, yeah, they Five. Probably. I'll do that. Okay. Did you never use your vacuum or your, um... The Hoover? Yeah. It's never been out of the box. It's brand new. Did you go 15 on it? Maybe even 20? Sure. All right. Thank you much. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Oh, thank you. Hey, John, how you doing? Hey, buddy? good. How are you doing? Good. You finding stuff? Yeah, so, so. Yeah. yeah. Like, like your biddies. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. What's your name? Terry. Terry, it's nice yeah. to meet you. Good luck to you. You too. Back to the house, and I had an excellent day at the garage sales. It didn't start out so hot. I think the first 10 sales or so, I just wasn't finding that much. And then I hit this sale. I guess we can go ahead and start with the best find of the day. This is a Toshiba TV with a built-in VCR and a DVD player. And it also has a uh, slot for an SD card. I've never seen one of these before. So right away, I was looking up comps. And with the remote, they're going between like $350 and $400. They didn't have the remote for it, but I went ahead and paid the 20 bucks. And I already found a remote on eBay and paid 15 bucks for it. So once that comes in, I'm sure it'll sell a lot easier. Got some movies on sale. Um, Arachnophobia sealed in the plastic. Although I don't think this is the first print. Well, maybe it is. Honestly, I'm not sure. I know horror VHS can do okay. And sealed VHS can do okay, so I figured, you know, for whatever it was I paid, I don't think $1.67, because it was like three for five, went ahead and bought it. Um, got the Edward Scissorhands uh, Steelbook, which is really cool. I might just keep that. And then the King Kong Steelbook. My buddy Luke is big into uh, King Kong. You know what? Scratch that. He's big into Godzilla. What am I thinking? Um, this one's got some damage on top, but I still might be able to get something out of it. Got some speakers at one sale. These are both uh, new in the box. She had some Sony ones too, and I looked those up, and they really weren't worth anything. Uh, this still has like the Pioneer tape on it on the end, and I think I saw this one go for right around 100, and these were going for around 80, both free ship. So I've got 15 into each one. Should be some profit to be made. Another TV I picked up. Uh, this is a Panasonic. Didn't even come with a remote because that's how old it is. Um, this one was going around 150 to 175 bucks. It's got that cool like wood grain panel. It was just like TV day it seemed like because I even found this one. This is a little Magnavox, uh, smaller screen, maybe like 12 inch built in VCR. Didn't have the power cord, but I've got one that'll fit it. I'll be honest, it's pretty rough. The odds of it working are not very good, but I only paid two bucks for it. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, how are you going to ship these TVs? I'm glad you asked. So if you saw my video from I think it's been a month, two months ago. I found a couple TVs at a sale, different sales, for like a dollar or two dollars each. And I've already sold both of them. One sold for like 90 plus ship. The other one sold for like 150 plus ship. I don't remember. Somewhere in that $100 range. And I shipped them both out and I got positive feedback. So hopefully that means no damage was done to the TV. So what I do is I cut out a piece of cardboard to cover the front screen. And then I do painter's tape all around to keep that in place. Then I get a heavy duty box at Lowe's, just like the thicker cardboard to fit it. Typically an 18 by 18 by 16 will fit. This one might not fit in there, we'll see. And then I buy a uh, mattress pad topper at Walmart. I get the full size, it's like 15 bucks, and I just get a layer underneath, I put the TV in, and then I just fill every single gap with that phone topper and it acts as really, really, really good padding. Shout out to my buddy, Jamie. He's the one that's giving me that tip. I've done that several times and it's worked great. Got this little Marvin the Martian, uh, plush, new with the tags for two bucks. I saw the same one sold for 20. Got this Panasonic uh, blood pressure monitor. This is kind of a funky thing. It's like a diagnostic uh, thing. I paid 10 for this. It's going right around 50. Found some records at one sale. A friend of mine is building up the record collection. So I bought uh, Bruce Hornsby in the range, Donovan, love Donovan. If you haven't listened to Donovan, check him out. There's another Donovan and another uh, Bruce Hornsby. And I got this cat picture kissing a bunny rabbit for a dollar because that just falls into the so ridiculous I couldn't leave it behind. Last couple things, I got some Buick um, hubcap. They're not the full hubcap. I think they just pop into the hubcap. Uh, but they had the part number on there. I paid two for the whole box and I saw these selling... 
right around 20 to 25 dollars each and lastly i got this hoover floor mate said she never opened it um i could still feel that it's sealed i paid 15 for it i saw the same one sell for 110. that's it for this video thanks for watching i'll see you next time <laughs>